Welcome back, Vapors. This is part two of my ranting. My ranting about reviewers, the vape industry, the vape products, the vape, what they're showing you, what they're trying to tell you to buy. This is part two of it. I had to go on and make me a part two. Now, I stopped on the last video telling you what gives me the qualifications of these vape devices. I, people, I, people, started vaping before any of these people that you watch on here okay and I'm gonna tell you why I vaped on the first Chinese cigarette vape device ever sold in America for almost a year I tried my best to stop smoking it was a cigarette looking device it looked like a cigarette it came with little yellow inserts in them with wetted nicotine cotton that tasted like tobacco and nicotine. It really tasted like crap, you want my opinion on it, because I was in a sales job and uh, running all over the country, and uh, and I needed to get off, I wanted to get off cigarettes, and the first one ever came on the market, and were out there in all the traveling facilities, you know, the ones where all the the truck drivers go, the big trucking places and stuff like that. They had them on the counter. It was just one little display when they first came out. This is, uh, you know, I, I forget what the actual dates of it were. I think it was the 80, 82, 85. Don't hold me to that, people. That Whenever they came out with the first one, the Chinese guy, I had them. I used them. I bought the, I, they were single-use uh, ones till the battery went out in them. Okay, I mean, you had a little charger, the charger for them, and, and that, you know, and, and you would take the little pot, like the little, it was a filter of it, and screw it on the end, that, that held your uh, little piece of cotton that was, you know, your wick in there, and it would uh, hit it off the battery, and you would smoke it, and even the little tip lit up to make you look like you had a real cigarette. In fact, I took these things into restaurants back in the day, and, and back in the day, you could sit there and eat, and then you start vaping your little thing, and they would come over to you. Oh, there's no smoking in here, sir. There's no smoking. I said, this is not smoking. This is vaping. This is, has nothing to do with any kind of cigarettes and all that. They would go, really? Yeah. I said, smell. You do, there's no smell. She said, you're right. And they would walk away, but eventually they didn't want any of it in, in the restaurant. So that didn't work, people. The vaping devices later on that came out in the last, seven years, ten years, they didn't work either to get me off cigarettes. The vaping products just four years ago, five years ago, didn't work to get me off cigarettes. It was about almost one or two years ago, about two, two to three years ago, Smock started to hit the market and some other companies. They finally made devices that threw out enough cloud and chuck and delivered enough nicotine that you could get off smoking cigarettes. And that's why I want the vape industry to move on. I want them to move on from the old crap. Get into the mesh and the profiles and the profile RTAs from Watofo. And the mesh coils for the companies with the the prefab coils you buy in the packs to put in species, smock species or Shigeli devices or Wismic or anybody, you know, those devices you can. And I'm not saying that all those are bad. I just prefer that the smock species over another 220 watt mod. And some of them are perfectly good. If you're happy with buying them, go ahead and buy them. You can put tank on them, whatever what tank you want to put on them. Okay, you can put your coils in there. I'm not going to bash uh the, the the fire fire and the free max and those they're, they're pretty damn good uh coils i just believe this one's better engineered this coil it's better machined okay but these if you want to stop smoking this is how to do it people buy one of these okay and stop smoking you don't have to carry a lighter with you anymore Nothing. Okay? You don't have to smell that nasty smell on you. 
You don't have to see that your walls in your home turning yellow. You don't have to have your lungs being killed by cigarette smoke. Okay? But don't be fooled by these reviewers out here that are trying to review every product in the ent entire world. Okay? That have nothing to do with you as a purchaser or over 45 years old that wants to quit smoking. Stick to me. Hit my like button. Hit my subscribe buttons. And I'm going to keep on giving you these honest videos about these products. Okay? And it's very easy to do. Um, I can tell you, uh, I'm going to put a link down in there to the people that I buy my products from. Uh, I do buy them from certain companies directly also, like with Tofo, I will I will buy from them directly. I will buy from Vandy Vape directly. I will buy from Smock directly. But the, the reason why I don't is because their prices are higher, people. I deal with WW8Vape.com in Las Vegas who has better prices because they get it in bulk and the prices are lower than on the actual manufacturer's websites. A smoke species right now is about 44 bucks the full kit without batteries. And if you go on the smoke website, they're going to want $89 for it. Why do that? And you, you'll wait from China to get it. You'll wait three, four weeks to get it from China. Don't do that, people. Don't do that. But if you want to stop smoking, you need to get a good over 200 water, 180 water above mod start with some prefab tanks uh, prefab tank coils uh and 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 go ahead and do it like that do it the right way after you do that and you get you really familiar with the e-juice and what it takes to change coils and you're vaping it and wattages and all that you can go out and buy yourself a little mech mod. okay a lot of reviewers will tell you no oh, no i don't know if i have a mech mod. When you're just learning how to, you no, know, if you've got three, three, six months in on a regular mod like a smoke species, go ahead and buy a little Mac mod so you can learn how these profiles work on top here with the mesh. And you're gonna go, why did I ever buy the other mod? You're gonna go, look at the flavor of that thing. Oh, I tell you what, I could, I can barely, barely pick up my own. You know, and then if you want to go even more higher end and get one that you can bottom fill in five seconds, you know, and uh, put a profile on it with a squawk button, or you can get a top side, a top side single. They're good devices. I'm not going to say they're not good devices to squawk with, but I I would put a profile on them. They don't offer you a, a worth a shit uh, RDA to put on top of a top side or a dual top side. It's, it's garbage. Okay. Now this one that comes with this TVL squawker, it, it it can have mesh in it. You don't have to buy a profile. You can put the mesh strips in from OFRF in that one that comes with this whole kit. I just bought the, the mod part because I didn't need it. I wanted to put my profile on. But the one that does come with the full kit of this, this TVL, has mesh capability and clapton. Okay, so you just buy some OFR mesh things and some Watofo's cotton, and you go ahead and uh, make it into uh, the mesh coil you want. I don't know if, well, let me take that back, because I'm going to hear a lot of comments. I don't know if the Watofo cotton would go good inside the the TBL RDA that would come with a full mod kit. Okay, so you might want to just use cotton bacon or cotton or somebody like that to do them. To do them with because they're really thick to a tofu so i don't know if it would work in those so i can't comment on that but um <clears throat> you know i hold the squat button down i've got a great regulated safe device i hit the fire button which is the fastest fire button i've ever seen and there you go i don't smoke cigarettes people i'm just trying to get you to 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 to, to People over 45 for Grandpa Vapor to tell you the truth. And I'm trying the best I can to give you the truth on these products. If there's any questions, I answer my my comments or I have somebody else answer them for me in my, my own words. Okay, so if you hit the like button for me, 
it doesn't cost you anything to subscribe to my channel people just hit the subscribe button okay and you'll know and then you hit the little bell on the right hand side you'll be notified when I come out with a video on a serious product that's technically advanced safe for you to use now in 2019 let's move on people get away from the reviewers that are trying to sit here and put every little device up there for you okay I mean if you're gonna if you're gonna go buy a pod system people you know They've got a gazillion of them out there. A gazillion pod systems out there. Okay? Just buy a stick. Buy, buy a stick or, or buy a Nord. Or buy a smoke pod system. Okay? Buy one of the similar to the, the smock or any other company that looks like them because they're all trying to match them now. And go that way. Don't buy all these little sticks and pins and and uh jewels and they're not going to deliver on the amount of smoke that you need as a 30 or 40 year old smoker in your 50s and 60s to get off cigarettes you're going to be disappointed you're going to throw it away and say this ain't working buy yourself a good over 180 watt device and when you go to take it okay You couldn't get that out of a Marlboro or a Newport or a Camel if you tried. And it tastes a thousand times better, people. So I'm, I'm, I'm done with part two here. Uh, I hope you people know that uh, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just trying to do the best I can for a group of people out here that are older. And I think that the older people out here are getting a bit offended or they just don't jive with the young little kids that are trying to push these vape review uh, sites and I'm not here to do that I'm not here with glitz and glamour and, and gonna try to start up uh, you know wearing uh, stuff from the, the 60s or or start showing you video games or any of that I'm here directly to keep the older people off of cigarettes now, y'all take care of subscribe to my channel. I love all y'all. Be good.